then the Jim Brown movie comes on, mm-hmm. which is a kick-ass action movie. Yeah. I'm sure where he's cool and yeah. and the crowd loves it. And you say you have never been the same. Yeah, well, and then your like, whole career, yeah. you've been trying to recreate that experience from 1972. It was yeah. a magnificent experience, especially being the you know uh, the son of a of a single mother. You know, and then and even at that point, uh, she was living with two of her best friends. So it's like I'm in a house with three young women. Uh, so being taken by a football player, like a Rams player, <laughs> to a Jim Brown movie uh, in 1972 on a Saturday night in an all-black theater, except for me, uh, that was probably the most masculine male experience I had ever had in my life. I was like, fuck going camping. This is it. Yeah, this is... <laughs> This is way better than fucking fishing. All right, uh, this is this is cool. I mean, what? But, I- you know, but 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 you know, but there is an aspect. I do say that it's like you know, when, either as a movie consumer going to movies and being part of an audience, or creating movies for an audience. That that goal of a Jim Brown movie in 1972 on a Saturday night is always what I'm trying well, to achieve. 